here we are adding 4444. Here we are subtracting 2222. So that literally means that literally means that in this case, in this case, because we are adding one constant one one everywhere, which formed remember this sequence is the one that just, uh, we got this progression here. That means that here our d is one. This is our d. This is our d for this progression. This is our d. This is our d. So in this case, d here is one. In this case here, our d is two. Here our d is four. Here our d is negative two. What we keep on adding or subtracting, and it is similar throughout, is what we call the common difference. Is what we call the common difference. So we are now introducing that arithmetic progression. And we are looking at the general terms. If A is the first value or the starting value, and D is the common difference, okay? And D is the common difference. Then, once we are at this stage, we can be in position to identify the nth term. I will say now, I will say, let n equal to the number of terms. Let n equal to the number of terms, small n. 